What's up everyone? Today is Monday, April 13th at 8 a.m. Gonna do a video watch this today. So for those that don't know, every Monday I do a free video watch this on YouTube uh, in the morning and then in the afternoon around 11 I do a free YouTube recap uh, where I recap all my live trades. So uh, every Monday I make this watch list free for everyone and then every day or every other day I make it for the members in MIC. So uh, let's kind of go over the uh, plays of the week. So one thing that I want to make note of is that um, we the market was closed on Friday for Good Friday. So a lot of traders have FOMO and a lot of traders are going to be starting in pre-market today. A lot of people are itching for a trade. A lot of people are going to be like horny teenagers where they just want to go, go, go. Reality is today, those who are patient will be the ones that are rewarded. So I'm just kind of keeping that in the back of my mind, uh, not trying to trade pre-market, trying to take it slow, be calm, and just wait for my setups to show up. So let's start. TLSA, this was a death line setup that we spoke about. Um, I forgot what it was, I think it was around, I think that was the death line, I can't remember, but basically death line setup, broke the death line and never came back. Um, so in the morning, Looking to short a pop towards red to green around 340. Looking to add, I mean, shit, it's at like three bucks now, so shit. Ideal scenario would be 340 because I don't want to really get into the chop here, but ideally 340, 355s with a 365 stop. CLSK, another kind of death line right when $3 broke straight down. So in the morning, hopefully we get a pop towards this kind of two, I don't know, it's like. 205 to 10 area. All right, it's kind of tough to see, but let me try to zoom in. Looking to short a pop towards these levels here in the morning. Uh, hopefully, we get up that high. Even $2 might be okay at this point because it's so broken down. CTSO, uh, this is kind of like a real company that has a large market cap and the chart is kind of like a breakout a little bit, so I don't really want to touch this on the short side, so we're just gonna avoid it. PSTI, if you notice, this stock is above Thursday's highs. So whenever a stock is above the previous day's highs, it is not short for me. That's very bullish price action. So on something like this, ideally we wanted to tank under $8, and then we'll short the rebound. I'm not looking to get cute on this, so we'll have more commentary at the open. Let it tank first, and then we'll attack. CANF is a former runner. Um, ideally, in the morning, we get a push towards this kind of 260, 270, 280 area to short. Uh, but if it just tanks like this, I'm okay shorting pop towards 250 or 260 in the morning. So let the price action confirm, and then we'll just short on pop. A lot of meat on the bone there. BCRX, um, this one is kind of interesting. It's kind of already, um, excuse me, it's kind of already fading pre market a little bit. So. In the morning, looking to short a pop towards three dollars. Right, looking to short a pop towards three dollars. Three ten. Oops. Three ten and three twenty. Shit. So I'm just waiting to see it tanked. So I'm just waiting for it to bounce, and then I will short the bounce. Last but not least, I actually missed this one until Bao mentioned it. I see the, this one kind of popped up and then gave it all right back. Uh, if I'm just drawing my lines, I can see very clear resistance spots around 850. I can see a very clear spot around 950. So in a perfect world, we get $9, 950 uh, to kind of scale in short. So let's see. Um, let's see, WORX is popping now. That's crazy. All right, let's do some research on it. Um, pull this up. Five million float, okay. Let's see if there's anything in the filings. Let me just check the chart. Chart is telling me around 8.15, some resistance. <laughs> That's a very dangerous stock. Let me check the filings real quick. Um, nothing crazy I see in the filings. All right, so we'll keep this one on watch. Uh, I'll kind of talk about it more in the room. So at the end of these videos, I like to do a secret word to make sure that everyone's listening to the very end. So today's secret word is gonna be iPhone. 
Uh, also, if you have any questions about trading or you want to get started trading, uh, you can text us directly at 213-458-5997. Uh, we're having that kind of an unadvertised discount during the quarantine. So hit us up and we'll see what we could do for you guys. So thanks guys. Good luck today and take it slow. I will see you at my recap on YouTube at 11.